Super Volcano Awakening, Geyser Eruptions, Ignite Fears Beneath Yellowstone. Yellowstone National Park, one of the most mesmerizing geological landscapes on Earth, is rumbling once again. And not just with the thunder of hooves or the roar of waterfalls, but from deep within the Earth itself. In recent months, a dramatic increase in hydrothermal explosions, sudden geysers shooting sky-high, and new signs of magma movement beneath the surface have reignited fears among scientists. Could Yellowstone's infamous supervolcano be stirring? This is not a fictional scenario. This is Yellowstone in 2025, alive, boiling, and possibly preparing for something unprecedented. Hydrothermal mayhem. Geysers gone wild. It began with an unexpected explosion at Black Diamond Pool, a once stable, thermal feature in Biscuit Basin. On a crisp morning in March 2025, a hydrothermal eruption ejected a column of scalding water, rock and debris, over 30 feet into the air. Startled tourists nearby captured the moment on camera, some screaming as the ground hissed and hissed, steam bursting from new cracks that had appeared overnight. In April, the powerful steamboat geyser, the tallest active geyser on Earth, erupted with incredible force, sending water nearly 400 feet skyward and rattling the surrounding land. Then it happened again, and again. By June, it had erupted eight times, a pace that has geologists on edge. This level of hydrothermal activity is unusual, even for Yellowstone, said Dr. Maureen Estelle, a senior volcanologist with the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS. It's not just the frequency, it's the fact that these eruptions are now accompanied by underground tremors and changes in thermal emissions. It's a sign something deeper is shifting. Magma on the move. What lies beneath? What's alarming isn't just the geysers. It's what scientists are detecting far below them. In early 2025, seismic data revealed a renewed flow of partially molten magma rising through the crust beneath Yellowstone's upper geyser basin. Thermal imaging and gas emissions suggest the presence of new magma pulses, which are injecting heat into the park's already volatile hydrothermal system. In fact, just months ago, researchers announced the discovery of a massive volatile rich lid, located 3 tower 4 kilometers beneath the surface. This geological cap, essentially a semi-permeable layer of hot rock, was found to trap and occasionally release high-pressure gases from the magma chamber below. This lid has long prevented a catastrophic eruption by venting pressure slowly. But now, gas output has nearly doubled, a possible sign that the pressure valve is reaching its limit. What we're seeing is a brewing cauldron, said Dr. Estelle. 
The geyser eruptions are like the boiling water on top of a pressure cooker. It's the rumbling underneath that has us worried. Yellowstone, the supervolcano sleeping giant. Yellowstone's volcanic system isn't just another volcano. It's a supervolcano, capable of unleashing eruptions that could bury entire states in ash and plunge the world into volcanic winter. Its last three major eruptions, 2.08 million, 1.3 million and 631,000 years ago, were apocalyptic in scale. While the probability of another super eruption remains extremely low, 1 in 730,000 in any given year, new signs of activity cannot be ignored. The magma chamber beneath Yellowstone stretches for 45 miles across and contains enough molten rock to fill the Grand Canyon multiple times. Even a small change in its behavior could have global consequences. And now, for the first time in over a decade, Tilt meters in the Norris Geyser Basin are registering uplift. Ground deformation of this kind is rare and often precedes either large hydrothermal eruptions or magma migration events. Hydrothermal explosions, silent threats. Unlike lava spewing volcanic eruptions, Hydrothermal explosions are often silent killers. When superheated water trapped underground flashes into steam, it can explode with the force of dynamite, launching rocks and debris hundreds of feet and leaving behind gaping craters. In 2024, a powerful blast near Porkchop. Geyser shattered boulders and created a 20-foot deep vent. Now, in 2025, similar explosions have been reported in Biscuit Basin, near Nymph Lake, and even near visitor boardwalks. We're dealing with a landscape that is pressurized, brittle and constantly changing, said park ranger Elias Granger, who helped evacuate tourists from a recent blast zone. Visitors may not see magma, but they're walking over one of the most unstable geothermal fields in the world. 